ever dreamed of turning your live production camera into a remotely controlled PDZ system that would have a much higher image quality and a much lower cost than traditional PTZ cameras. If you have a DJI gimbal and a Blackmagic camera lying around, uh, well, you can already use the DJI app or the DJI extension kit to control your gimbal remotely. But the issue with that is that the range of the app is very limited and it isn't very suitable for live production. This is where our latest product edition comes in, the Middle Things APCR. With the APCR, you can control up to 8 DJI gimbals remotely from a single laptop, and all that using inexpensive yet very precise USB gaming joysticks. Um, the APCR connects to your main router using Ethernet, meaning you can have your control room very far away from the cameras. Uh, this allows you to turn your existing camera setup into a high quality, remotely controlled PDZ head at an affordable price. But what's more is that the APCR features a built-in Wi-Fi receiver, meaning that the gimbal and camera control can be received wirelessly from our desktop app or from Atom software control if you have an ATEM. Now, how does the magic happen? Uh, first, you connect your APCR to the DJI gimbal focus wheel using the included connection cable. Uh, the APCR now controls the DJI gimbal. If you have a Blackmagic camera, the APCR will also control the camera settings through its built-in Bluetooth antenna. Next, you just have to connect the APCR to your router using a very long Ethernet cable or wirelessly using the built-in Wi-Fi antenna of the APCR if you are, for instance, in a small environment. Finally, connect your laptop to your router's network, open up the middle control software, and here you will see all your APCR units. And that's it! You can now map all of your joystick access and buttons to gimbal actions such as pan, tilt, roll, speed or the zoom motor. If you use Blackmagic cameras, you can also remotely control shutter, iris, white balance, gain, focus. And if you have an Atom switcher, you can connect our middle control desktop software to the Atom to control more advanced uh, camera settings such as luma, gamma, lift, contrast, saturation, and sharpening uh, using Atom software control. So as you can see, the APCR hardware and the middle control software are really designed to blend seamlessly in your live production environment. Now, if you plan to use the APCR with the latest DJI RS2 gimbal, you can have access to additional features thanks to the canvas port of the APCR. The first one being the ability to control the DJI focus motor in addition to the pan, tilt and roll motors, which means you can use that DJI focus motor to control the zoom of the vast majority of lenses out there, and you aren't restricted to using lenses that have internal zoom servos. The second feature the APCR offers when used with the latest DJI RS2 is position presets. Uh, you can save custom camera position presets and recall them later. Uh, for instance, if you have a conference with three different speakers, uh, you can make one position preset for each speaker and for each preset the APCR will save the corresponding pan, tilt, roll and zoom motor value of the gimbal. Moreover, if you use uh, Blackmagic cameras with an ATEM, uh, you can also store the current white balance, ISO and iris value into each preset in addition to the gimbal motor information. Uh, finally, if you use a Blackmagic camera that has an MFT lens mount like the Pocket 4K, uh, you can also save the current focus value. For those of you who are using the Elgato Stream Deck, that button pad with customizable LCD buttons, uh, note that we are working on a BitFocus Companion plugin so that you will be able to recall your presets easily using companion software. If you currently work with an Atom switcher, you might wonder how you could control all of your camera settings wirelessly. Uh, let's say you have moving cameras on stage and you cannot have any wires attached to them and you are using Holyland or Teradek video transmitters that can send the video but cannot receive camera control information. 
Well, it's a quite different situation, but the APCR will come in handy too. You can use the built-in Wi-Fi receiver to control the gimbal and camera completely wirelessly. You can bring your Wi-Fi repeater very close to the stage and have a steady cam operator moving around freely. When the Ethernet cable is disconnected, the APCR will automatically switch to Wi-Fi within a few seconds. The wireless range will depend on your router. If you put a more powerful Wi-Fi router you will get a better range. So that's it, uh, you can pre-order the APCR today on our website or through our reseller network. It will start shipping in July on a first come first served basis. You will very soon be able to download the new middle control software that supports the APCR. Uh, it's only available on Windows for now. We know that many of you are on macOS only so we really are working on the macOS version as well which will uh, be available a bit later. Other than that well we really hope that you like this new product uh, if you have any questions please let us know in the comments of this video or at hello at middlethings.co and we'll be happy to help uh, stay safe and see you soon